All right, what is up guys? So today we're testing out the snorkel. We're gonna try to hydrolock the Forerunner. If you guys wanna see the snorkel and you didn't see the previous video, I'll link the previous video down in the description below. So let's do it. I'm just gonna run through these puddles and these are pretty fucking big puddles. So we'll see how well the snorkel holds up. I'm, I'm really curious. There we go. Probably should put it in four wheel high first. First puddle is so scary. It's a lot more than a fucking puddle. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my god, it's so much fun. Round two. So far, so good. I'm impressed. Before we had the snorkel, it would have already been bogging down right now because of all the water. I only went worse shot. Fuck, no, it's not. <laughs> oh, God. I just realized my door is not shut. It's like cracked open right now. Well, the drone didn't get wet, that's good. So there you guys have it. Test the snorkel, works great. We didn't go underwater with it, but as you guys can see, those are some pretty gnarly puddles. That, that doesn't even sound cool, gnarly puddles. Like, those are some pretty big ass puddles and the truck's running fine. It's not bogging at all. It's got all its power. We're good. And uh, to all those saying that the snorkel is really constrictive, I've honestly, I haven't noticed any difference. If anything, it's slightly better. I realized since we used a smaller pipe right into the air box that may have constricted it a little bit, but I'm really happy with how it turned out. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and we'll see y'all tomorrow because it's daily video time.